can't believe oh it. Oh my gosh, she has teeth or something in there. All right, I wanna welcome you to BTR Outdoors. And right now I'm just uh, standing in the garden looking at my giant sunflowers. Um, they're taller than me. I'm six foot two. These things are supposed to get up to 12 feet, but I don't know. Let, let you take a look at one of them. It's kind of cool. They're always pointing towards the sun. I guess that's why they're called sunflowers. But the reason for this video is my last video I did on Gulp Alive and how well that worked. And I wanted to try in the same spot my mummy worms. So in this video, I'm gonna be uh, seeing how the mummy worms do. And also, how are they, how are they lasting? Are they, uh, are they still holding up? Like I said, I've, I've had them for a while now, probably since October, November, I believe. I could be wrong on that, I'm not sure, but I've had them for a while. They've been stuck in my truck, been stuck in my tackle box all kinds of places and i want to see how well they're going to hold up so i hope you enjoy this video and uh let me know what you think let's get started let's try these mummy worms i've had luck with them in the past I know these other ones work. What about these? Secret spot. <laughs> well, the mummy worms work. That was instant. That was instant. He hit that sucker hard. Pretty nice. All right. Miss it. hook it a couple times get to stay on the and that stays on the hook but once they hit it it's usually gone whereas the uh, other ones I've been using they'll stay on there for several fish Seem to stay on a little bit more. Seem like a little one. Got it. Got it. All right. Doubling it up, just to make it a little bit harder for them to get. Oh. Ah, 
see. It did stay on. That was a pretty good hit. Double it up again. I don't know what's wrong with this cord. Biggest one so far. Oh my gosh. Look how big that, that one is. It's a nice one. Look at that. Come on, buddy. Thank you. Alright, also I wanted to give you an update on the mummy worms, the mummified wax worms. Um, I got those in green and yellow. Uh, I want to say I got these last winter, so they're probably about seven to eight months old. And if you break them open, they're still juicy, just like the package stated. And these also have been left in my, my tackle box in the pickup for extended uh, periods of time. And they're so good. And that's what I like about these is they stay on the hook really well. And they'll last forever. You don't have to worry about keeping like worms alive. Um, you can always just throw these in your pocket, in your tackle box, go off and catch fish. Okay, one thing I wanted to show you. And the container really works well too. Sorry about that. I just want to show you how juicy after eight months that they still are. The inside is very juicy. Outside um, has a kind of a tough texture a little bit and that's what causes it to uh, to really stay on the hook really well. Especially uh, going for perch and stuff, they can be you know, rather aggressive. With a tough outside and the juicy inside, um, the fish really love it. And you can catch several fish with just one worm. And like I said, I've used it. I really like the green ones. Um, you can see the yellow ones, um, these things come pretty full when you order it. And I'll give you a link in the description where you can order it. Um, you can tell I've used the green ones a lot better. I really like the green ones. And uh, I've caught a lot of perch on these. And I still got the, this is what's left of the original package. And I can catch a lot more perch with what's, what's left in here. All right. Okay, well, I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, just a little recap. The gulp alive worms, they did stay on the hook a little bit better. But if you hook the, uh, the mummy worms uh, twice, they seem to stay on a lot better. And I could catch more, um, more than one fish just on one uh, worm. But they turned out they worked out really well. Um, I'm impressed with both products. How well they hold up under heat 
you know, that's one thing I like about using the gulping alive and the mummy worms is you don't have to worry about keeping the worms alive or it being too hot, having to keep up with that. Um, like I said, I just keep them in my truck. Whenever I go fishing, I grab them and go. So, hope you enjoyed the video. Hit that subscribe button. It helps my channel grow and it is growing. And I want to thank y'all uh, so much for uh, making my channel grow. Uh, hit that like button. Hit that comment button. Leave me a, a, a comment and I will get back with you. All right, until the next video, we'll catch you later. Y'all have a good one.